Hey y'all, Rhonda here. I was just sitting here working on a swap with Miss V. Uh, VNA? I think that's how you say it. Anyway, <clears throat> turning out, it's going to be really cool. Anyway, this is laminated, and then you have your different signatures in there. Um, anyway, it'll be really cool. I'll show you all this in a little bit. But my daughter just brought in some mail. And let's get it opened. Hope everybody's doing fabulous. <clears throat> All right. I got, I have a big one, big bag, a medium bag, and then I have this. This is from, let's see, Stamp Club Tonic Studios. So let's see what this is. Tonic Studios had one, um, <clears throat> and I don't remember if it was Reach for the Moon or Reach for the Stars. But anyway, it sold out like super quick and just absolutely loved it. And I think I was not the only one. I think a lot of people said, hey, we're wanting this bad. So they brought it back. So I had, and then they have one that's the opposite. Like I said, one, one shoot for the moon and the other one shoot for the stars. So I ordered both. And I'm hoping that's what this is. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> this one is Shoot for the Moon. And I love how they come in these folders. Very nice. So look at the dies. Oh, loving that moon and the mountains, stars, stars, trees. Look at that. Is that not gorgeous? Now do you see why I was throwing a fit that I wanted it so bad? And then I love it that they, like I said, come in these little pouches and you just stick them in your tonic book and you're good to go. Love, love, love. All right, let's do this kind of medium one. Some scissors here. I've already had a busy day. Had to run to Springfield, which is about 30 minutes from here, <clears throat> to an appointment and come back. Is that everything? Yeah. <clears throat> all right. Oh my goodness, all kinds of fun stuff. All right, well, <clears throat> let's just dig in. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I'll do my best to link some of this below. I'm having a hard time getting the just the actual link. Um, when I when I copy the link, it like copies the page and tells you how much it is, and like a description and everything, and not just the link. So I'm trying to get that figured out. <clears throat> oh, little free gift. That's neat. Oh, and this is a steampunk. Um, I don't know if you can see. <clears throat> anyway, it's a like a moth. It has all kinds of different pictures in there. Um, anyway, very steampunky. <clears throat> so I got. Let's see. I purchased several of those. Like I said, it'll be kind of hard to see until we get it cut out. Oop. Did I cut it enough? Well, I have to be careful because I don't know if a stamp or a die is in there. It feels like a die, but you never know. Whatever it is, I don't want to cut it and gill it. Right? I oh, hope everybody's doing fine. It's a beautiful day in the Ozark. Sunshine and it's warm. <clears throat> Come on. Well, good lord. Surgery on this. Oh, <clears throat> this is neat. You see, this is suitcases, a stack of suitcases. So that's going to be fun. Piece that one together. One thing about AliExpress, you never know when it's coming in. <clears throat> I ordered some of this the same time I ordered some other things, and the other stuff came in within 
I don't know, a week or two. This has been a while. Oh, I just thought that was pretty. I mean, you could add that in the corner. You could make several of those, layer them up. Yeah, I'm liking that one. All right. <clears throat> but, oh, yeah, big butterfly. I had this one kind of made up steampunkish, too. That's a big one. Let me see, I think I have my ruler. Oh, let's see here. This is about five and a quarter across. And about five, uh, four and a quarter down through the middle like that. So that'd be a pretty statement piece. <clears throat> oh, here's several. Oh, this is some more of that steampunk. So this one is <clears throat> actually a fish. And you can kind of see the body there and then all the different pieces that go with it. Okay, and this is a submarine, and, oh, this is a heart, you see the bottom of it there, and around, all the gears, <clears throat> uh, and this is a gecko, and tree branch, that he'll be on, and all the gears. This one was really cool looking, this owl, <clears throat> the way they had it done up. Very, very cool. Excited about that. Oh, couldn't open this one. What is this? Oh, we have some beads. We have some, what do you call these, rondelles? These are the little spacer spacer beads. You see, these are have the little blingy on the sides, all different colors. So they're silver and gold. But these are, like I said, the little spacer beads. And it's funny because those showed where they weren't going to come in for I don't know when. It's funny how it just kind of drops off the tracking and then it shows up. Oh, this is something really cool. <clears throat> uh, Midodo, Midodo Craft. I think that's how you say it. Anyway, this is, um, <clears throat> I've never seen anything like this before. You put this little card together. I don't know if you can see the picture. Okay, from here. And then this, this middle part rotates and keeps rotating and goes all the way around. So I'm excited to make this, see if it really works. I mean, I'm sure it does, but see if I can get it to work. How's that? All right. <clears throat> see what else we have here. Something big. Oh, beautiful Asian stamp. Of course, I have all this, you know, stuff to make tons and tons of Far East journals. That I'm working on. That's gorgeous. I hear something rattling. Oh, what is this? Oh, got a little, little surprise. They sent me little goodies. So there's a little fish and a snowflake. Little dies. Well, that's sweet. <clears throat> Very sweet. And. And this is Amelia Craft. I like I said I bought several things from from her or from them or let's see. Oh, everything. Okay. This is oh, I just thought that was beautiful. Just a butterfly and all the little zhuzh. 
I just thought that was really pretty. That would be pretty to um, ink up. I know it's a, um, a dye, but you can ink it up and then heat emboss it. Uh, yeah, we're going to have to try that one because I think that would be really pretty. <clears throat> All right, now, what is this? So we have a big bag here. Let's cut into this. And see what we have. Oh. All right. There's a box. <clears throat> My goodness. A gift that keeps on giving. All right. <clears throat> Let's see what we have here. Hold those up to the light. I don't want to. Don't want to cut anything. Oh, oh. Okay. No beads. I'm glad I was careful. I didn't cut any of those. So this is how they come. So I got two different sizes. You can see. So those are pretty. Just kind of surprised that they just shipped them like this. But you know, hey, I'm not not complaining. Love those beads. Of course, I love anything orange, you know, fall colors. Let's see. This is wrapped up. Oh, more beads. <clears throat> oh, here we go. Alrighty. I thought these were really neat. Look at those. Blues and greens and I just thought those were really pretty. For the dingle dangles. Alright. <clears throat> It's so funny when I do this, I think of um, Craft Diva, was it Craft Diva 29? She does this and she goes so fast and and uh, I think she's so cute. But anyway, she goes fast and she's always saying, moving along, moving along. So here is some charms. <clears throat> so there's some spacers and all different kinds of things in there. I don't remember ordering this, but I'm sure I did. These feel pretty weighty, too. Those are nice. Moving along. <laughs> My homage to Scrap Diva 29. <clears throat> she does make some beautiful things. All right, let's see. Can we get this out of here? Oh, yeah, this is the, um, it's a layering die. There's three different dies in here, and uh, you cut them out and layer them, and uh, yeah, I'm excited about this. You can kind of see the design. We'll do that one really soon. I'm anxious to try that one. <clears throat> All right, what is this? Beads. Oh, these are those... These are really cool spacers. These are heavy, too. Let me see. Am I focusing? Focus, focus. But yeah, these are a mixture of bronze, silver, and gold. I love those. <clears throat> oh, this is kind of bumpy. Let's see what this is. Uh-oh. We have one on the loose. I'll just stick that one back in there. Oh, yeah. These are really cool. I'll open these up. <clears throat> so you can kind of see what the what is. Those are really neat. Different. 
get them back in there. All different sizes, shapes. But I love that bohemian style, I guess you'd call it. <clears throat> and, of course, I love turquoise. Oh, these have some charms in them, too. Oh, look at that big one. Oh, and a lock. These are really cool. Yeah, these are, I'm very pleased with these. <clears throat> okay. And this one. These are charms. Huh. I don't remember these. These are different. Okay. These are, oops, all kinds. <clears throat> These would be good with mixed media, too, with uh, some of the 3D canvases that I make. Okay. So if we can slide these in here, just in case we have more jumpers. Okay, let's we'll save that one. Do this little one. Oh, goodness. To stretch there a little bit. Oh, I just thought this was a pretty flourish. Love that. That would be great with all the different journals and things. Let's see what this is. Maybe, oh, this is not crafty related, but I just thought this was cool. <clears throat> this is a silicone and trowel and scraper. Is that not cool? I just thought it was very cool. So it gets your old trim up or silicone, you know, your grout um, around your shower tubs and things like that. Um, gets it up and then... When you lay it down, it smooths it out, and it has the different shapes um, on the nose there. I just thought that was pretty cool. So that's a little DIY gift there for me. <clears throat> okay, let's see what this one is. Oh, yeah, it showed these weren't even out of the country yet. That's funny. I was anxious to give these a try. So these are... Um, Envelopes, storage envelopes. Oh, these are nice. Um, you know, that you could put your magnet sheets in there and then store your dies or your stamps. So I got two different sizes. And these are top loading. Open these. <clears throat> Yeah, so these are top loading and they feel pretty sturdy. So we will give them a try. I just wish they had a side on them, you know, like where you could put put them in a three ring binder. But, you know, hey, I am not complaining. Not at all. All right. So the last thing we have here. Any guesses? Any guesses? Let me get my get this out. <clears throat> All right. Is it dies, stamps, beads? Where she lands, no one will know. No one knows. Oh, beads. Oh, look. Ooh, those are pretty. And these. Oh, wow, look at these. Let me open these up. These are weighty, too. These are nice. Look at those. Oh, I'm pleased with these. 
There's 80 in this bag. <clears throat> and, oh, I like these. These are those little flying saucers. The spacers, like I got the, um, I have the really little ones. These are the bigger ones. Look at those. Are those not fun? Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. All right. So that was a quick little little haul there. So I appreciate you spending some time with me. And until next time, bye for now.